especially these seniors, to you know to have a hard-fought, tough loss on Thursday night and then battle back like this. Uh, it was against a team that was as hot as any team in our league. They had won five out of six. So, you know, I love these guys. It's been a, a privilege to coach them at home. I told them these are hard days as a coach because when you have a good group, it, it, it can get emotional. But I wasn't going to get overly emotional because I really believe these guys have a lot of basketball left. Um, I really believe that, and but just you know, they got great families that are here, and all of them really, really played well today. From Dennis having a career high four assists for a, for a forward, which is unbelievable, to Nakai's last ten minutes, and Brian just to, you know, like I always say, he's the guy that that uh, he is the horse that pulls the wagon. He he knows how to strain. So p please talk to these guys, but good, good team win. It doesn't always happen, but yeah, to get them out, uh, that's all I put Dennis back in. I don't want to get hurt or anything like that, but you know, you want to get these guys recognized. You know, uh, we're back, we're in the mix, we're having a good year. Um, I still think we can have a great year. That'll be determined March 8th to 10th down in, in D.C., but I'm appreciative of these guys to get us back in the mix. Dennis, how cool is it in your fifth year, I guess, to, uh, to win uh, your last game in yeah, it's a, definitely a great feeling. It's definitely been a long journey. Every game is a big game. Our next goal is to cut down the nets in March. Thanks. Thanks. Ryan, uh, you guys got off to a good start. Reflect on the, the previous game. What was the difference sort of to get off to a better start this game? Uh, just having energy, um, playing uh, together more, connected, and just moving and sharing the ball. And obviously our defense and rebounding is what. Uh, that's what we do. So we just do what we do and have energy doing it. I, I thought just not to trip, but I, our energy was great the other night. We played hard. Sometimes this game's as simple as the ball goes in the basket. You look a lot better. I mean, we've defended, we've rebounded today. The ball went in early, and the other night we had some great shots. It just didn't go in. Be a difficult team to defend, right? I mean, they shoot a lot of threes. Hit some at the end. They hit a lot at the beginning, I guess. Uh, long shots, long rebounds. I just worry about the rebounds coming off. Uh, the forwards don't really shoot that much, so it's kind of the same for me. Yeah, because they're going over our heads, and the guards got to come down and rebound. <laughs> Gang so. rebound. Yeah, sure. yeah guards did a much better job in the second half. I mean, look at, you look at Allen with four, Jason with five, Brian had seven, Jakai three, so that was, that was a really good job. No, you know what, and I always say this, um, I think this group has had great ball movement. You can't get an assist unless the ball goes in the basket. So sometimes you can throw a good pass. If it doesn't go in, you know, you don't get the assist. I, I, I think um, these guys, I can't, like I said, can't say enough that they've been an unbelievable group to coach. Um, we'll go on the road next week to play two good teams. We'll get ready. Hopefully we can keep getting better. And then we need to play our best basketball two weeks from now. I mean, it definitely means a lot to me and my family and uh, uh, the fans as well. Just playing, playing hard all day long. Uh, it means a lot to me uh, for giving them my all to my teammates, my coaches, my family that come supports me every game, and uh, the university, the staff, everybody, the students that go to the school. So it's just, you know, it's been a blessing. Like they said, it means everything to me, especially to play in front of my family, all the people that believed in me. All through all the stuff I've been through, so it means everything. Brian, Brian, how do you feel the team is at right now going to the last two birthdays? Um, I think we're in a pretty good place right now, uh, so we're excited to get going, and um, you know we see how we how we're gonna do. Yeah, we gotta stay healthy. We only got eight of them. <clears throat> you know, <laughs> it's hard to like to told our strength coach put them in bubble wrap all week and then get ready to play the game. We got eight guys; they all gotta play a lot for us, so it's just gotta stay sharp this time of year. Watch other games. I'm going to go home tonight and, and really enjoy myself and be happy for my guys. And then last question, uh, obviously, as a senior, you know, senior day, get, uh, Jason Gibson, uh, we were missing. They talk about his, his game, 19 points, so four assists, five rebounds. Uh, describe his effort and, and talk about the play uh, where he threw you the pass uh, for the dog. Oh, yeah, that was crazy. That was a nice pass. I don't even think he just meant it to pass to me. He just threw it to our side and we got it. So Great house. I had a you know, quick instinct, you know what I'm saying? Because my family said, you know, I'm kind of slow with everything sometimes. So. <laughs> you know, I, I had to get that quick, so. But that wasn't shocking by Gibby. We call him Gibby. That wasn't shocking by Gibby. 
we see we could do every day in practice. He go hard. He's a great leader out there, the point guard. So. Yeah, he can shoot the ball, pass it really well. Yeah. He's a good player for us. Tough. Yeah. Great piece for us.